Okay, I've got a story that I want to share with you that uh, I found pretty amazing. Now, the story is about a gentleman who owned some land in Africa, and at this time, I believe it was the 1800s, a lot of people were mining for diamonds. They were finding diamonds, becoming wealthy. Well, this individual, he heard about all everyone else's findings, and he wanted to go off on his own to actually search for these diamonds. So what he decided to do was sell his land. And he ended up finding a buyer and he sells his land. So he begins his journey um, following everyone else trying to find diamonds. Now, as the story was told, he searched for diamonds, but he never found them. He lost everything and he ended up killing himself. And he never found these diamonds. But the individual that we want to talk about today is the individual that purchased the land. Now, this person that purchased the land had no idea what was on the land, but he was walking one day, and by a stream that ran through this particular property, he saw this really bright, shiny stone. Ended up finding out that this stone wasn't just a stone, but it was a diamond. He went back and looked on his land and found a lot more diamonds and ended up being one of the largest uh, diamond fields um, ever in history. Now, the the moral of the story is, is that uh, the individual that actually sold the diamonds, the gentleman that sold the diamond field, he was actually sitting on all of the gold, all of the diamonds, all of the wealth that he ever wanted. It was right there with him. And um, when I thought about this story, I really think about the individuals that right now may be selling off their dreams. See, to me, the diamonds are the dreams that lie within you. The problem is, is that we never take the time to actually search for those diamonds. We spend more time trying to find diamonds somewhere else outside of ourselves instead of looking within. See, I truly believe that inside everyone, there is a diamond field. There are fields of diamonds, but the problem is, is that we have to mine for those diamonds. And what I mean by that is we have to work for the diamonds. We have to find them. We have to dig for them. And a lot of people aren't willing to dig for the diamonds that lie within us. But I truly believe, and you've heard me say this, we can live the life that we want to live. We can do the things that we want to do. And we can go the places we want to go. But it's going to take time. It's going to take time and it's going to take effort and belief and faith that within you, there is a diamond field. Don't start wasting time and selling off all of your dreams because you hear about what everyone else is finding, what everyone else is doing. If you stop worrying about what everyone else is doing, look within, you will find the field of diamonds that I truly believe that are inside of you. So the message is simply this. Today, start mining for those diamonds. Get your shovels out, get your picks out, and let's start searching for those diamonds that are with inside of us so we can actually share what we find with everyone else. Well, it was a spectacular story. I really hope you guys got some out of it, and we will talk to you soon.